my research is about personal finance. So where I'm looking at different concepts about personal finance, for, uh, such as um, finance uh, capability, finance well-being, and within finance capability, I'm looking at finance behavior, finance capacity, and finance literacy. Um, so I'm trying to understand the links between those um, uh, concepts about personal finance and uh, how it influenced to the way people perceived about their financial well-being. So looking at the context of um, the UK finance capability, uh, in 2018, the um, reports show that uh, over 10 million people uh, rarely save or never save money. And over 11 million people have less than 100 pounds in their savings. So that's something about um, finance behavior that people need to um, manage their monies better. I have been working in the commercial industry for over 10 years, so I would like to uh, how to convert the um, industrial experience into education. And I hope that my uh, experience, knowledge and skill can uh, transfer to students so they improve their employability. Um, that's the first thing. Um, second thing is because I'm now I've shifted to social marketing, which um, promotes social change and social behavior change. I would like to do something about social change and social innovation. So I think it's good uh, to work for um, in academic areas where I can work with government or um, other bigger project in that have a bigger impact to society and community. While I'm doing re uh, this research, um, I had an opportunity to do some interviews, um, not only for my research, but I'm doing um, another project um, for the Monday Advice Service, which is uh, working with the Open University and Coventry University. And when I engage with uh, learners and we discuss about how um, their finance situation was and we talk about finance education and their feedback was very positive. So in general, I think when I'm thinking about my research challenges or difficulties, I, what I remember are the positive things about um, the support of my supervisors and my faculty. So during data collection, when I need more incentives to encourage more people to involve in my project, um, even it wasn't successful, but my faculty was fabulous. Like they responded straight away, approved my fundings, so I can offer more incentives. And my supervisor always there because um, the, my um, data collection quite tight in terms of timeline. So when I have something need their approval, they always responded very quick, and we was brainstorming what to do, how to do, and we find a way to, to, to find a solution. So for me, that's the positive thing to think about these challenges and difficulties.